lonely from the world's capital markets. Here are the financial headlines brought to you by Arise Academy. Good morning and welcome to our daily financial outlook. Join us today as we survey the business world for the latest events and updates in the markets. Michael is helping today from our trading room. Gold and silver prices rebounded slightly after back-to-back -back losses that left the yellow metal at its lowest level in two and a half years. When the Federal Reserve chose to go ahead for the third consecutive interest rate hike to contain inflation running at a decade high, stocks and bonds markets around the world got nervous. The Fed's move, followed by Russian President Vladimir Putin's announcement regarding escalation in the war with Ukraine, pushed an already soaring US dollar to a 20-year high. Bankrupt crypto lender Voyager Digital said that crypto exchange FTX has won an auction for its assets in a bid valued at about $1.42 billion. The Bitcoin dollar pair dropped 1.1% in the last session, after rising as much as 5.9% during the session. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal, going against our overall technical analysis. Facebook's stock fell 2.5% in the last session. According to the CCI, we are in an oversold market. The Aussie dollar pair fell 0.6% in the last session. The MACD is giving a negative signal, which matches our overall technical analysis. The gold dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.1%. The Williams indicator indicates an oversold market. The Irish retail sales will be released at 1000 hours GMT. Japan's coincident index at 0500 hours GMT. Japan's leading economic index at 0500 hours GMT. The US MBA mortgage applications will be released at 1100 hours GMT. The US EIA crude oil stocks change at 1430 GMT. Germany's GFK Consumer Confidence Survey at 0600 hours GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets.